What's up guys, Groovy Guitar Dude here, and the first thing you want to know for the greatest by Sia is that you're going to need a capo on 3rd fret. The next thing you're going to want to know is the four chords we're going to need for this song. The first one is going to be A minor, the next one's going to be C, the next one's going to be G, and the last one is going to be F. Next you're going to want to know the strum pattern. Now for most of the song, actually just a simple single down strum is going to work. But if you want to get a little bit more complex with it, especially in the parts where it gets a little bigger, the big choruses and um, the bridge, stuff like that, you can use a down, down, up, and then up, down. So that'll sound about like this. Now everything except for the pre-chorus of this song is actually going to be the same exact chords in the same exact pattern. It's going to be A minor, F, C and G. So obviously you guys will kind of know what that sounds like if you're doing just single down strums. So I'm going to show you what it looks like if you're doing that strum pattern that I showed you. That'll look about like this. Now like I said, the only different part of this song that changes from that chord progression is going to be the pre-choruses. What the pre-choruses are going to look like is going to be F, C, G, and A minor. So you can either use your single down strums for that or you can do that, uh, that strum pattern that I was telling you guys about. So I'm just going to show you with the strum pattern because obviously single down strums, you guys got this. But with the strum pattern, that's going to sound about like this. And guys, that is about all you need to know to play the guitar part for The Greatest by Sia. Guys, if you have any questions, don't be afraid to hit me up in the comments below. I'm really quick getting back to them. And if you liked this video, hit that subscribe button. I make a lot of videos like this one where it's like songs that may not have guitar in them or rap songs or pop songs that don't actually have guitar parts. And then I make guitar parts for them that fit with the song. So if that's your thing, hit that subscribe button so you can see more videos like this one. Guys, I hope you all have a wonderful night, and I will see you all very soon.